I cannot believe you just played that word. Oh yeah, believe it, girl. Hey guys, what are you doing? Oh hey, we're just playing words with friends. You want to join us? Yeah, sure. Let me just grab my computer. <laughs> really? Why don't you just use your iPhone? I can't. I uh, don't have a smartphone. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Has this happened to you? Have you been the victim of social ostracizing because you are without the latest technology like your friends? Are you tired of it always happening? Well, don't worry. You're part of a natural process we all live through called diffusion of innovation. Not sure what that is? Don't worry. By the end of this video, you'll understand. Diffusion of innovation? That's a mouthful. I definitely don't know what that is. It may seem confusing at first, but don't worry. It's easy to explain. Just ask this professor. Hello. This theory is an explanation of the way we adapt and accept new technologies and media into our lives. Once this new thing is introduced to someone, they let their enjoyment of its convenience be known to others, who will soon go out and find the same thing. Let's take a look of an example on the board. As you can see from the board, the theory can be explained by the enjoyment of music. It all begins with the invention of the phonograph record, or vinyl as young people call it. It was the way to listen to music for the longest time. But then there was the introduction of the cassette, an 8-track making music enjoyment easier and more convenient. Records began to start phasing out in popularity. Then by the 1980s we saw the introduction of the compact disc. Much better in terms of quality than previous models, and it reigned supreme for the next 20 odd years. But now we're in the middle of a new revolution in the way we get our music. The digital format is becoming more popular by the day, and CDs are now on the decline. This may all seem a bit difficult, but I feel it can be explained with this short film. See, the theory can take effect almost immediately, giving people no time to catch up. And there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> I'm gonna go now. I think it all makes sense, but what can I do? I don't want to feel out of the loop. Well, that's simple. You have to become an early adapter. That's where you find the next innovation, adapt to it early, and make sure you get your friends jealous enough to adapt to it as well. It's the American way. Jeepers, mister. That makes a lot of sense. I'll do just that. Thanks a lot! Hey guys, what are you doing? Hey, we're just playing the game on our iPhones. 
We'd ask you to join, but, you know. No, it's fine. Besides, I've got the next big thing that's going to wipe the iPhone off the map.